और युद्ध तो अवश्य भावी है तो युद्ध भूमि में इंडिया इज लैंड ऑफ रामायण एंड महाभारत एंड विजय बैटलफील्ड इज अ पार्ट ऑफ आवर हेरिटेज As said by the poet, the soldier atop a galloping steed, yelling the battle victory cry, dragging the flag and banners one. Oh, it is such a treat to the eye! Student of Rainbow Public School, Janakpuri, demonstrate the return of victorious in medieval India. The return of the victorious, India, the land of the great epics of Ramayana, victory in the battlefield, very much. अत्यंत आवश्यक है कि हम अपने व्यक्तित्व को बनाए अंधेरे से उजाले की ओर चले अंधेरे से उजाले की ओर तो माँ दत्त आर्य प्रेजेंट अंधेरे से उजाले की ओर मृत्यु अमृतम इन आर श्लोक अस्थमा सत गमय तमसोमा ज्योतिर गमय मृत्यु माँ अमृतम गमय इट एक्सप्रेस इज अजायर टू मूव फ्रॉम लाइफ फुल ऑफ फैलसी टू लाइफ बेस्ड ऑन ट्रूथ ये संदेश दे रहे फ्रॉम डार्कनेस टू इग्नोरेंस ऑफ टू द लाइट ऑफ नॉलेज एंड फ्रॉम डेथ ऑफ इग्नोमिनी टू द डिजायर ऑफ इमोटैलिटी आर्य विद्यालय दरियागंज के छात्र
darkness of ignorance to the light of knowledge that was a message from rani datta arya school darya ganj now what if we mix love item, peace PR, unity uh, and integrity in the next presentation through pyar ka jazba or expression of love this presentation comes to you from nk bagrodia public school rohini pyar ka jazba here it is pyar ka jazba of
That was Pyar Ka Jazba. To tell you more about peace and Pahun harmony, come in Nalinas Kohli. Anchal. Thank you, Vinod. And from Mama that, we now have a presentation by the children of the Ganga International School, Hiran Kudna, who will, through song and dance, pay homage to our motherland and pray for peace and harmony all over the world. Indeed, an important message from the land of peace, the land of Mahatma Gandhi. These students are presenting and praying for peace and harmony through a dance and song performance. भले फूले और इसी आंचल ने हमें शौरी शांति और प्रगति का रास्ता दिखाया है माँ तुमसे प्रार्थना है कि सारी दुनिया को शांति में बना दे माँ का आंचल From that message of uh, peace and harmony, After it's over to Vinod for Chow from West Bengal. Thank you, Nalin. Welcome to E Zone Cultural Center, Center Kolkata's presentation. Purulia, Kolkata, a city Bengal. loved by many. This is a Chow dance of Purulia is presented form, by them. It is one of the proud possessions of the folk art form, a vigorous um, form of dance drama with masks and elaborate headgear as ornamental Ramayana. apparel are drawn from our two great epics, Ramayana and Mahabharat. Chow from West Bengal.
राष्ट्रपति जी tell them about Bar it nalin kohli bharat mein aaye thank you vinod in fact the next item is a very popular Mahamad item here which is the motorcycle rider display from the border security force when 90 riders on 19 motorcycles from various field formations and called jabars will be riding in the display of various motorcycle trees before kiya tha saluting days right here akashwani aur ken se aaj bhi vice president krishan kant thoda sa president kya narayan was sanik jo ke seemao par also present there and that's the first of the riders coming in which is the borderman salute and the salute to the president akashwani aur doordarshan pe ho raha hai right there we can see him aaj subedar swadesh singh chudawa unke liye leader of signal the motorcycle display army headquarters bsf called jam group se vyavastha ki hai और ये हैं बहादुर बॉर्डर सिक्योरिटी फोर्स सीमा सुरक्षा बल के मोटरसाइकिल सवार कहलाते हैं दांतों तले बैलेंस रिकवायर्ड द नेक्स्ट इज द एल पोजीशन व्हेन टू राइडर्स उसके बाद माउंटेड ऑन अ सिंगल बाइक इन एन एल बहादुर जाबाज एल आकार में सवारी करते हुए कोऑर्डिनेशन ये प्रिसिशन आकृति बनाना एंड करेज नाउ इज द बहादुर व्हेन एट राइडर्स ऑन वन मोटरसाइकिल फॉर्म अ ह्यूमन पिरामिड देखा जा समानांतर संतुलन के साथ नेक्स्ट इज द पैरेलल कमल का फूल बनाते हुए When किस तरह से इतने सवार मोटरसाइकिल पर देखने से ताल लोग रखता है कमल का फूल बनाते हुए और अब इसके बाद आएंगे हवाई जहाज और जब तक इस पर आएंगे हाल से लिए राजपथ कमांडर बाय स्क्वाड लीडर पैंगिंग दिस आर द लास्ट ऑफ द मोटरसाइकिल राइडर्स The center Sukhoi the is now pulling up towards the sky, of the three and Sukhoi 30s. they have now turned right. And that's right. the aircraft which because approached in a big formation at a height of a thousand feet, maintaining a speed of 780 kilometers per hour. And continues straight at 850 kilometers per hour. Going ahead with a vertical charge Charlie Rose, Charlie Rose right in front of him. And finally, straight at 850 kilometers per hour. Going ahead with a vertical Charlie Rose right in front of the saluting days. A spectacular sight indeed, and always. And the fitting end to the Republic Day celebrations right here at Rajpath in New Delhi. The Sukhoi the 30 is a state-of-the-art fighter, remarkable having tremendous capabilities and, course, and capable of delivering a heavy punch to any enemy. Proceeds completing the turn now and disappearing deep into the skies. The cloud and getting a thunderous away from roar the indeed of the Sukhoi. The Sukhoi 30. The an amazing of sight Force, indeed. First, the motorcycle riders from the BSF, and then the fly past the fly of past Sukhoi 30s. What do you say, Vinod? Absolutely scintillating stuff here, pulsating stuff here, Nalan, and, and, and uh, people here are absolutely thrilled, and particularly uh, given the fact that uh, visibility has been so perfect today—a nice sunshine, bright little morning here, and so enjoyed by everyone. सेवा निवृत्त नारायण श्री कृष्णकांत वाइस प्रेसिडेंट श्रीमती कृष्णकांत इक्वल टू द रैंक ऑफ फील्ड मार्शल ऑफ द आर्मी एंड इट मे बी रिक्वायर्ड फॉर जनरल मैनिक शॉ एंड जनरल करियापा वो ग्रांड टू द ऑनरी रैंक ऑफ फील्ड मार्शल ऑल इन थ्रोन बाय टुडे शो हियर द सेलिब्रेशन ऑफ द 53rd रिपब्लिक डे इस सम्मान पर न केवल भारतीय वायु सेना बल्कि तीनों सेनाओं को और साथ ही देश के हर नागरिक को बॉडीगार्ड वंस अगेन अर्जुन सिंह जी को गिव द नेशनल सैल्यूट टू द सुप्रीम कमांडर ऑफ इंडिया आर्म्स फोर्सेस वायुसेना अध्यक्ष की भूमिका उन्होंने अदा की फेवल के समय राष्ट्रपति अंग रक्षा दिन Indeed, the magnificent parade has been. The visibility is phenomenal, and which has added to the spectacle, the colourful spectacle here at Rajpath. As the nation is just is concluding the celebrations of the 53rd Republic Day, the VIP enclosure, dignitaries, the president, and people indeed from all walks of life, from all over the country, present here at the Rajpath. The president's bodyguard making its way in front of the. 
saluting Hello. his deputy, Major Bhanu led Bhanu by Colonel G.S. Malhi and his deputy, Major Bhanu Pratap Singh, to offer a salute to the President and Supreme Commander of the Armed Forces, for which the command will be given by the National Anthem. And the National Anthem will be performed here. The day home by the bands of the saluting base. That as always will be there to remind us of the sacrifices and that have gone into making India such a proud republic. Also, way back in 1950 when we became a republic. That is the commander of the president's bodyguard, Colonel Malhi, on their fine steeds, presenting the salute, Rashtra salute. National anthem and into the sky the formal conclusion we'll see balloons of various colors the colors of the tricolor making their way into the sky carrying the message of peace harmony sacrifice across the world as the celebrations of the 53rd Republic Day are drawing to a close on a clear blue sky today it's indeed a beautiful sight isn't it Vinod Absolutely, these balloons are really as the VVIPs uh, go away uh, from the Rajpath. We see these thousands of uh, tricolored balloons which uh, possibly symbolize the aspirations and confidence of the people of India to become a superpower sooner than the world might imagine. Let us also now bow our heads in gratitude and memory of our grand soldiers, sailors and airmen and also other men and women in the uniform in the paramilitary forces who have done more than their might to keep this country together. Yes, uh, we know you are very right and uh, we can see the dedication uh, on the faces of the people and our leaders, Prime Minister and the President as they come down, smiling, very happy with today's proceeding as they watch the ascending balloons in tricolor, taking the splendor all over the sky and reminds us of the great republic which India has become in the morning of yesterday, where the sun is shining very clearly, a beautiful day, and I am quite certain that Mr. Qasim Uttim has been impressed by this magnificent parade, which I can clearly say is the biggest military parade, parade in, in the world. Absolutely, uh, but of course we missed the presence of uh, the columns from the Army, Navy and Air Force. Of course, the spectacle was no less, however, with the presence of equal calibre, from the paramilitary forces. That's right. And the, the president's bodyguard, Karib Karib Colonel Mali, saw his, 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 uh, steeds, is now is he preparing Raj to turn right as the president's car moves. And with that, Major uh, Vinod Krishna, we must baad, remember dhe 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 that though the, our armor, our army column and air force column were not there, but the memories of the fallen brave are, is with us. And I can I would like to say that gas with honorable scars, low in glories, lap they lie, though they fell, they fell like stars, streaming splendor down the sky. Their memories will always remember and we shall always cherish the memories as we can see from the traces of determination on the faces of our dignitaries, of our visitors and our soldiers. Colonel Mali turns his uh, bodyguards right. 
Colonel Mali shall be on the right, followed by his number two on the left of President, and other two divisions under Risaldar Major will be in front and in rear. So the President's car will be completely covered by the colors. Truly impressed by the spectacle, I'm sure the song in everybody's heart today will be Hum Honge Kamyab. We shall be the victors. As the time go on, go on. And these beautiful uh, flowers and this lovely shot that was taken by our camera symbolizes the beauty that lies in the hearts and minds of all our Indians. As the president's motorcade and now on way towards uh, the Rashtrapati Bhavan, towards the western side of Rajabad, the other one, the eastern side being the India Gate, with the mentioning. Others to follow will, of course, be the Vice President, the Prime Minister, and other dignitaries, including the Defence Minister, Sri George Fernandez and his colleagues in the National Cabinet. This parade well, that is uh, Sri George Fernandez, the Defence Minister, seeing things uh, as he must have overseen all these arrangements. A tremendously tense atmosphere that must have gone on behind the scenes. But of course, uh, Prafal, you will agree that as far as the spectators was concerned, there was no, no sort of uh, sense of awe or uh, any sort of anxiety as far as the security aspect was concerned. Precisely. There was no apprehension, anxiety or even fear uh, amongst the people who were gathered out here because the security had been so good and so tight. And of course, we can... Uh, we can safely say and we can very uh, uh, proudly say that this uh, has been done because of the great effort put in by the entire security system and the police and the military and all the other agencies which are at, were at work to make this magnificent day a great success. With that, uh, the Vice President of India, Sri Krishnakant, has just uh, departed uh, towards the Rashtrapati Bhavan. And in the waiting now is uh, the cavalcade, which will take the Prime Minister, At the conclusion of this Sri Atal Bihari Vajpayee, this feeling is extremely Rose satisfied with the proceedings. By way, we have fought back. And with that, we return you back to the studios of Doordarshan and myself, on behalf of my colleagues Nalin Kohli and Major Vidhan Krishna, I, Prafal Bakshi, wish you all a very, very happy Republic Day.